Hey, hey, thanks for tuning in to Top Model Talk Show with your girl, Miss Tanisha, baby. I'm super excited because today we have live guests in the studio. <laughs> and these guests are very special to me because they are NBC alumni. And what that means is they're Molly Bootcamp alumni that they have actually taken my program, okay? And now what I did was invite them to the studio to ask me questions that may have not been answered during their training. So we're gonna start with Jordan. Jordan, what's your question for me today? Um, my question is, what is the biggest mistake an aspiring model or actor can make um, during the start of their career? Great question. I will honestly say one of the most um, harmful mistakes a aspiring model or an actor can make at the beginning of their career is just thinking that they know it all, okay? When you come in thinking, hey, I have a cousin that model, or I used to model when I was four or five years old, uh, I've been in the Target ad when I was, you know, still wearing Pampers, all right, that does not count. You have no idea what's current, what's happening right now in the industry, okay? That is a big mistake. You should always be open to learning, okay? You should always be open to growing and actually educating yourself on the business because it changes, it constantly changes, okay? So coming to Molly Bootcamp, all your questions even there were not answered, all right? So with that being said, you have to continue to invest in your craft. You have to invest in your portfolio staying updated. You have to invest on your comp card staying updated. And some of you, I'm saying these words right now, you may not even know what a model comp card is, but guess what? You're a model, right? Okay, that happens a lot. People say, I'm a model and never really know what the basic industry tools are. So one millionaire said, great advice. You can say, I know, I know, but if you haven't actually done it, then you do not know. So until you actually take those certain steps, then you don't know. So model portfolio, model comp card, okay? Then after you get a model comp card, you gotta submit yourself to an agency. Are you signed? Are you a signed model? Or are you a so-called, I'm a freelancer. I was told I don't have to pay. Well, guess what? Nothing is free, okay? You can't get great photos by a family photographer or a wedding photographer even. Wedding photographers don't always know fashion, okay? So you have to understand the business. You have to know what it means to have a fashion photographer, a commercial photographer, someone that actually can give you what clients are looking for for your model portfolio. So these are a lot of things that um, are important as a model. Now as an actor, it's your craft as far as acting. Can you actually act? Okay, just because you are extra on a set, okay? That's great, great start, right? But extras very rarely have a speaking role or they actually don't always get to show their ability to act. So being that that's on your resume as an extra, that really does not show an agency any confidence in you. So again, invest in your talent, invest in your skills and your career by taking acting classes, okay? On my resume, I have a lot of acting work. I had to pay for my acting classes because I wanted to become an actress or an actor and I've had the blessings of doing that. So again, invest in yourself and please do not think you know it all because if you're not having the room to grow, you're gonna fail before you even start. Thank you. You're welcome.